going on people hope y'all doing fantastic so over the uh course of the weekend my pastor during uh the church service he said would you rather have wisdom or or money and while you think about that uh go you can go check him out he's up there on the on the column up on the left uh the channels to check out pastor dow he puts out a lot of information useful information that you can apply to everyday life and it's not uh it's it's not it's not religious like some of the some of the uh these other pastors out here but um now would you rather have wisdom or would you rather have money my answer was i would rather have wisdom why well i got a lot of videos out here just using facts uh i have a lot of videos out here where you know i put i share some of the wisdom that i have obtained and i try to give it to you sometimes i just break it down to where you know you can simply understand it sometimes i just go just say it and hopefully you get it hopefully you stop do your research do your due diligence and you know try to come to a conclusion of you know what i was speaking about but you know, when it comes to wisdom, wisdom helped me buy this truck. I didn't go to a bank uh, because my credit was jacked up. I haven't used credit and I haven't used consumer credit in, I don't know, five years or so, something like that. So even if I did go to a bank, they'd be like, man, get out of here. Um, because I was following the Dave Ramsey, but I'll just use cash for everything, use debit, you know, the debit card and all this. And okay, well, that works good to an extent. But if you're in business, you're going to need to have some type of credit. You know, even if you don't use it, you're going to need to have some type of credit. And that's the point I'm trying to get across. You know, so so here's this guy. Credit's jacked up, you know, um, because I, I I cleaned that up, you know, the credit. I don't have hardly anything on my credit file anymore. Um, nothing that's current anyway, right? So I go to this guy and, you know, and I, I didn't slick talk him or anything. I just said, hey, you know, I want to buy your truck. You know, your trucks, I hear your trucks for sale. Here's what I can do. Um, pay you every month, so on and so forth. Uh, do you think that will work for you? Yeah, that will work. We cut the deal. We're good. Now, if I had a lot of money, I'd just go buy the truck and be off, which, I mean, if I had the money, but I didn't have the money. So that's a, that's an example. Another example is when I was talking about the freight brokerage, uh, becoming a freight broker agent. And I was saying that I can sit here on this side, in the trucking side, and say, you know, all the, well, it needs to be this way, it needs to be that way, it didn't need, this needs to be that way, but until I get on that side and understand what's going on on the broker side uh you know i then i can get a better understanding of of what's going on so i mean and that i apply that to a lot of uh a lot of things in life now some areas i'm just like i don't know and you know i'll go seek it at that time if, if it's something that interests me i'll go seek it out if not i mean it's, it's no really no concern um now, with that being said, I would rather learn the process when it comes to money. I would rather learn the process on how to do things rather than focus on on the dollar. Like I make reference to uh, a couple of my videos. I make reference to Donald Trump. Uh, Donald Trump is whether you like him or not. I mean, I'm just using him as an example. He's a great businessman. Uh, he owns multiple corporations and he knows how to utilize different strategies and techniques and so on and so forth. That's not what this video is about. But I'm not concerned about if he's a millionaire, if he's a billionaire, you know, what's his, uh, uh, what's that thing called? His, uh, um, the financial spreadsheet thing. What is that thing called? You know what I'm talking about? It just slips my mind right now. It'll come to me in a minute. But I'm not concerned about that. 
what I'm concerned about, not concern, I shouldn't say concern, but what I want to know is, okay, how do you do this? Okay, you have, whoops, drop the camera there. Oh, there we go. How do you do this? Okay, how do you do that? Okay, you got this business over here. Okay, this business holds all the assets over here. Then this business leases the assets to this company. And then you got this company that manages this company. Oh, I see how it's doing now. See, everybody's focusing about the money. I ain't looking at the money. I'm looking at the process. Um, so, and I just dropped some nuggets right there. So y'all need to stop the video and go check that out. But see, I'm looking at the process. Um, and I mean, that's just how, that's just how I'm wired. That's how I like to think. Um, uh, so that may not be for you. You just may want to go out and, you know, and, and, and get a whole bunch of money and, and everything else. And I was watching a video, um, I was watching a video, uh, Golden Child's video. The, uh, I don't know what the title was. I don't, I don't, I don't remember, recall right now, but, uh, and he was talking about, you know, he has different assets, income producing assets that will allow him not having to physically work every day. And that's great. You know, I'm, I'm happy for the brother, you know, and you know, I would, uh, I would love to sit down at his feet and say, all right, bro, yeah, teach me, you know what I mean? Um, so I don't have to work every day. Uh, now in his video, he said that he hasn't, he hasn't taken a load in, uh, three weeks, I think was it three weeks or three weeks or three months or something like that. Um, that's, you know, that's fantastic. And I, I'm just bringing him up as an example. Cause you know, you should go. So you check him out, subscribe to him. I'll go put his little thing up there. I just, sometimes I forget, you know, to put the, uh, you know, the people's faces up there and uh, move my finger out the way. There we go. I'm trying to get out of the sun, too. Um, put the people that, you know, that you should check out, you know, my recommendations. But going back to uh, that type of situation, you know, some days you don't want to run this truck. You know, you may have something. And I'm not saying that I'm not saying that to, OK, get in a situation where you, you, where I just want to sit at home and, you know, put my feet up. Uh, that's, I, I that, that's boring to, uh, to me. That's boring. You know, I'd rather be out, you know, looking at, see how something works and looking at the, you know, lift them uh, under the hood and okay, that, well, that's over there and this is doing that. And, oh, that goes over here and everything else. I mean, that's just me that, you know, if that's not for you, Hey, that's cool. But, you know, I like to obtain wisdom so I can apply the wisdom. And then at the end of the day, I can show somebody else how to do it um, or sell you <laughs> how to do it. But most of the time, it's just show you how to do it. You know, hey, do this. You know, if you do this, this and this and, you know, um, and move on from there. Uh, because, I mean, that's just what I like doing. So that's all for this video. Um I hope you found something useful in it. Uh, if you're not on the Trucking Tribe email list, I'll put the link down below. Go ahead and subscribe to that, and we will see you on the next one.